Right, welcome to this week's episode of Mini's and Motorbikes. Well, we've got loads going on now, haven't we? Yes. Should we crack on really quickly? Because there is it. loads yeah. to do. And nobody wants to hear me waffling no. on. Yamaha. Yamaha bike. Yeah. Right, should we head over yes. there now and have a look? Come on now. Well, that looks like a different bike to me. It does. The guru's clint it and clint them all out. Look, he's made a lovely job with oh, it. Is it. Oh, is this back uh, from... Uh, yeah, from Steve. From Steve Burgess, and, is it? Um, I did get him some new screws for it, but I've got lot, no, the first lot were too short, the first lot, the second lot were too long. Third time was just right. So this, Just right. So, just right. Hang on a minute. This is the bit that yeah. we were trying to take apart on the bench yeah. and you blew some bits out, but... Yeah. I didn't quite... But he had to do something yeah, else. He reckons what it was is a load that the... The petrol in the tank has gone all, yeah, and there's loads of bits of black bits in it. So we've got to take the tank stop, uh, cock out and uh, see if there's any black bits and all that sort of stuff in it, because there was a load of black little black bits inside inside that car. Right. Um, so yeah, it's clamped all that out. So we'll, we'll give that a go a bit later on if you like. Okay. And I did notice as well. Look. What do you mean give it a go? You mean fire it up and see if it up, goes fire again? Up. I did notice that a lot of, a couple of these HT leads are really all cut to shreds. They're all sort of cracking. Right. So I've bought some new ones. But, right. but getting them is a complete pain in the arse. Why is that then? Because you just can't get them for this bike. Oh. Of course, if you come in here, you come in here, look. I will do. Fixing holes too far apart. Well, oh. on those too far apart, screw on to where the, the old ones went. Oh. But they all come with just the lead separate and you screw the leads into them and then I've bought some N N NGK spark plug caps and I've screwed them on, you screw them on at the end of the bit of wire and you put the things on. So we, we might need them, might be part of it, don't know yet. But right. we can give that a go, can't we? Alright, we'll, we'll give it a go, we'll give it a go yeah. and find out later on in the episode. Yeah. So stay tuned yeah. to see if it starts up. So do you want to see the bike seat first? That'll let's go and have a little bike seat because we left you with that last yeah, week. And then didn't we, we take the stop cock out the tank if you yeah. like. Yeah, yeah let's go the, back over to the seat. Like. Let's go back over to the seat. Yeah. Alright you look. Some more ad cam. <laughs> I know lot Mark loves it. <laughs> well, we've done a little bit more of the fiberglassing. And I think we've got enough layers on and bits and pieces. I've put some of this thin stuff, I don't know if you can see it's almost like silk. Put that on the outside and then that, that lot will be filled then. Filled these holes in the top here. Can you see them? Yeah, done them on the inside and the back bit. We've finished another layer, couple of layers on the back bit. And then that hole there has been done on the other side. So I think that's all the holes and the cracks done. But I will sand it down properly. I haven't sanded it down fully yet. I'll do that a bit later on. I've got to take these, these screws out and redo them. But what I might do is just give it a quick sand over, get clean off with some body wipe, give it a quick sand over when that's all dry, and then um, try and fit it to the to the um, to the frame. Looking a bit different, isn't it? It does look a bit different. I've sanded it right down there and it's shown a load of cracks, basically. So I've made, I've sorted them out. If you want to come in, I'll show you. Um, obviously, we had that big one the other day. I haven't sanded that filler off yet. I'll just give it just a quick little dirty fill just to see that. But there was a big crack across there, or actually just there. So what I've done, I should put another bit on there to strengthen it. I'll put one bit across it. You can see the, the shape of it there. 
and I'll put another bit on it. Um, that and I had a massive crack there, so I've put a bit of uh, a bit of fiberglass over that. And then this other side, this other side here, that had a crack on it, so I put a bit of um, put a bit in there as well. Let's have a look, so you can see that. Right, that um, was quite um, like you've done nothing, didn't it? Yeah, which is a good thing. Yeah, I'm not having a because what I'm going to do then, and I'll fill them as well. Obviously, that will fill them holes in with with the old flexible filler, and that's sort of come up all right. I mean, it needs another fill, but the fiberglass isn't straight and even anyway to be fair so it needs another feel on that um, right. but it's sort of done that it's, it's, i'm quite pleased with it it's looking all right isn't it yeah so then it's coming up all right what's the next stage oh. to do on that then um just carry on with the filling um and obviously take the paint off around where the, where these fixing holes are because when we when we come to fit it i'm going to make some carbon spaces up that fit in there like a carbon washer because i've got right. that carbon two mil carbon plate and i right. so i'm going to change these bolts these bolts in here they can be changed and then just carry on with the filling. Now I'm just going to give it about three coats of primer filler. Why? So it takes out all the little real, real sort of imperfections and hopefully that'll come up quite nice and smooth then. So I filled the Do you sand it at all in between priming or you just prime it three coats of primer? Um, I've, I don't know yet. See what it looks like? Yeah, I see what it looks like. But I've done the back holes as well. Look, we've done them and then, and then filled that. Hmm. Yeah, right. I think the ghost is about to be. Someone's. Someone's it. upstairs walking about, yeah. aren't they? I ain't upstairs. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes. A couple of kids at work were worried about thunder and lightning, and they were going, Dad, Dad, this is thundering again, it's thundering. I said, No, it's not, it's God moving furniture. <laughs> and then, of course, he's coming again, it's thundering, and the girl's coming, she said, Dad, Daddy, Daddy, it's, it's, it's all right, it's, it's only God moving furniture. <laughs> it's true, though, isn't it? Anyway, yeah, so that's that then. So what I was going to do with that is um, spray that with black tetrasil, you know, the undersil you put on cars. Um, yes. Like swartz, 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 what yeah. they call it. I was going to just spray that with that. Yeah. Because it's, it's better than that using that than paint, I think. Um, I mean, very often it's just it. left like that, isn't it? It's yeah, just but I'm going, raw, paint, isn't it? I'm going to paint it black because it just looks nice, doesn't it? If that's yeah. all painted nice. How, how's paint it normally black. left? Yeah, like that. That's how it's normally left. Yeah. But you're going to do it black? Yeah, I'm going to paint it black. So then when it's taken off, and I'll sort this bar out as well, so that's all nice and, you know, you know, yeah. you know, you know the score. Pokey pokey. All right, so yeah. next time we see that then. That should be in grey primer. Well, I don't know, about it. I've got some grey primer, but I've got that white filler primer we used on this, haven't we? So I could use that and then it'll be all white. Right back to the Yamaha then. Yes. You reckon you've done the old I've, uh, I've rigged it up so I can get some feel to it, because I don't want to oh. use it, I don't want to use the tank. But don't look too closely at what I've done because it is a real bodge. <laughs> oh, okay. But, but it's going to work then, is it? Hopefully it will, yeah. But the only trouble is, the only trouble is. What's the trouble? Is hmm. I don't know what the fuel's like in the tank. I've emptied some of it and it looks really clean. Um, but the fuel wasn't coming out of the, 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 the petrol cock, the stock, the, you know, pep cock. Yeah, the, the peggy, the, so the, the, the peggy bad cock. I'm yeah. wondering if it is all just all blocked up with gunk and crap. And that's what was stopping it from actually starting and running properly. Because um, the guru said that the... Um, I can't think what bloody... Oh, dearie me. The this pilot is... jets, I think he said, or something. The only one of the jets, uh, he said they, they weren't actually... Because we thought that's what it was. They were blocked, but they weren't. He said they weren't that bad. You could see through them. So he said it weren't that bad. So he seemed to think it might be the tank that's a problem. I tend to agree with him from what I've seen earlier on tonight when I got up right. here before you got but here. But if you've rigged up this, like, tempy yeah. kind of bottly thing going down... Yeah, so in theory, then, that... we shouldn't get any crack going into it yeah. by using that. But it all depends what the fuel's like. Yes. So, so, so it's still touch and go. Yeah, we take the we take the petcock out of the tank and see what the fuel was like on that. The, the gauze is like on that, and then get some fuel out, and then we try it and just well, we just oh, try it. Well, you want to do that now? Yeah, I should have gone and got now. some. I should have gone and got some fuel, but I didn't have a chance. Oh, right, never mind. So let's go and have a look at the tank then. Yeah, come on. All right. I've got some tools. I've got some other bits here as well. So we just see. But it weren't coming out of, out of that spout. Right. So I'm going to undo it and see what the feel was like. I wonder okay. if it's the right. Oh! So we take this out, see what it's like, and hopefully we might be able to pour some enough fuel into that cup to get it to work. That's what I'm thinking. The only other thing I might have to shoot off and get some fuel, perhaps. We we'll see, we'll see how we get on anyway. We we'll see how we get on. But I reckon it's had a crack in there. I reckon that's been leaking there, look, because all that paint's coming off. 
And there's, it looks like there's a crack there. Someone's filled that with bloody um, body filler. Look, you come in. Am I coming in? Come in. Now, give me a little screw drop. It looks like it's been filled with body because all that paint was coming away, I noticed. Right, that looks like body filler there, yeah. look. Yeah. Yeah, I know. There's a leak yeah. there, look. Yeah. yeah. That's a right old. Uh, it's bad, isn't it? That's a right old mons up, isn't it? As they call yeah. it. Yeah. Oh well. There you go. Got to repair on the tank to do now, haven't you? Are we putting that original tank back on when we get I, it? Going? I don't know yet because I might. I might turn it into, into a tracker, but the trouble is the shape of the frame might stop us doing that. Right. But then again, I don't know yet. <laughs> We've got enough to do at the moment, haven't we? Right. Let's see well, what the scores is like. It looks all right actually. But there is a lot of there's them black bits look that's getting into it. I reckon someone's put something in the tank. There's little black bits around here, I don't know if you can see them on my finger. Yeah, see just about. That's what that's they were in the car brown when Steve stripped it. Well when we stripped it and Steve stripped it, he, he had a load of that come out. Oh, oh, nearly, oh I'll oh. try to zoom up on your finger then. Hang on, let me get some more on there. I zoomed up on your finger, without you move, you'll keep your finger still. Oh, oh dear me. Oh dear See? me, dear me. It's all round there. Not very good at all, does it? No. Right, Don't you me? go cutting sandwiches now with the fingers like that, you know? <laughs> <laughs> sandwiches? Sandwiches? Sandwiches. Right, mm. let me just wipe that off and we'll see if we can pour some of that into that cup without... See what it feels like. Here we go. Watch me cop this right Here we up. Go. Gonna be... Watch me cop this right Gonna up. Gonna be stuck peeing everywhere now, ain't there? Oh! Yeah, it's all black bits in it. Can we filter it a bit? <sighs> mm, I don't know. See, the fuel looks all right. It's just tiny little, you see the tiny little black bits in the bottom of it? Mm. I don't know if it's the tank blasting or what it is. Mm. <laughs> Where you been? Oh, it's never going to work, was it, all them bits? So you've gone and got new fuel? Seven? Tootsie fruits! Quid? Hey, you've got to be Paul Getty these days to buy petrol, ain't you? Paul Getty? <laughs> Prince Charles. Oh, King Charles. King Charles? Yeah. Yes, I can't get used to that neither. Uh, yeah. Yeah, so we try that then, shall we? All right, put then. It in the bowl and then... So, we can leave the tank there. Yeah. Your new fuel, yep. over in the old uh, white container. Yep. yep. Bob's your uncle. And he's your aunt. Should we do it now or should we can have a look at the seat thing? Because you've we're, been we're working a lot the on the seat, seat as well, haven't you? Shall I bring it over to the bench? Bring it over to the bench. Right, you stay there, I'll go and get it. That was quick. It was. Didn't have to go far, did you? No. Right, let's have a look <laughs> at it then. Hang on. Well, it's not oh, live, isn't it? <laughs> oh, just run out of fuel. <laughs> Anyway, yes. Oh, I'm so, oh, a bit disappointed about that, though. It's a bit harsh, isn't it? Well, never mind. It's obviously got a pinhole in it, isn't it? Yeah. Anyway, I might be having a new tank anyway, so I don't, I'm not really that fast, to be, to be honest. I think I'm in there for now. <laughs> I'll tell you what, this is looking a bit different, isn't yeah. it? But it was, only, it was only, what, two shakes ago? Yeah. That you were rubbing it and yeah. buffing it and priming yeah, it, 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 and it, it needed a lot of work. There was a lot, and there were a lot of cracks in it. Um, but of course, obviously, I've taken it past the the gel coat and the primer uh, to get down to the bare thing. And of course, there's a lot of little pockets where, to be fair, it's just a cheap racing. Thing. They must must have made hundreds of them. Yeah. Um, so it is what it is. It's a little better now, though. It is a lot better, but you can see, I don't know if you can see the little pinholes and everything, we've got to fill all them. Mm. But I just wanted to get it so it's so I can see what's what, really. Yeah. Yeah, so there's, there's, lo there's, there's loads on that, but I just wanted to get it so it, it, gives, a, it gives us an idea of how far we've got to go with it, then, doesn't it? But now you can see um, that, you can, can see put that, a bit yeah. of body filler on it and sand yeah. it over and uh, spray it again. I mean, there's a low spot there where, you know, so, so yeah, it needs a bit of work, but... Yeah, but it's miles yeah. better than what it did. Miles better than it was, you know, all the cracks have gone, you know... So yeah, even that, even that back bit, let's have a yeah. look at that back bit, because you were, like, yeah. putting a bit of uh, yeah. stuff on that. That's come up all right, hasn't yeah. it? Yeah, so it's just come up all right. Yeah. So what, fit that on the next episode? Yeah, unless you want to do a little test fit now. Do a test if you want to see, you're going to follow me. Walk I'll follow you. I'll, yeah, walk this walk way. This way. Yeah. <laughs> I'll do a little test fit. Yeah. Yeah. So, 
Yes. Oh, it's hose. It should stand on that. It should stay there, shouldn't it? So that goes on there like that. It goes on there like that. And then we've just got to fit it to this back bit. Probably right tight at the back here, I reckon. Right on the end, end, edge of it there. That right end bit, I reckon, they will do it. So go there like that, so it's sitting quite. And then what I'll do is I'll put some rubber, rubber, rubber bungs behind it. So when it bolts on, it just bites onto that rubber. Yeah, and it'll help for a bit of yeah, vibration, yeah. won't it? Yeah. And then on the back, I should put some, I should put some rubber strip on top of there as well, because I noticed there were cracks on the top of that. Right. So I'll put some real thick rubber on that as well, so hopefully that'll stop all that. Right. Yes, look, you right, isn't I mean, it? I am tempted actually to fix it in the top because I think it's actually touching on the top. Whether we do two fixing holes in the top. <sighs> Does it need on that, it? On that frame. It wouldn't crack so much then. I reckon that would crack and break if it's on there. Right. I'll have a, I'll have a, I'll have but a what's thought. it going to look like though with two holes connected, like and screws? Oh no, it look nice because 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 we'll probably have, you know because we'll have the uh, I'll have a we'll have a couple of dome um, dome bolts in there for that bracket, the bolt into that bracket. Right. So we'll have a couple of dome bolts there and a couple of uh, dome bolts there. Mind you, if it is on the side, we can have a proper Allen bolts, which he likes. He doesn't like the dome bolts because the the Allen part of the dome bolt. Um, um, it's all arsy and funny and it strips itself out so right. okay i suppose you'll be rubbing the tank down soon wouldn't you yeah i've Getting started it? a little bit on that you can film a little bit of that as well tried some new um paint stripper right because i bought some from uh tool station and it wasn't really man enough it was more for domestic stuff and of course you can't buy it because of the chemicals and everything for you on your hands mm. can you so they've they've sort of uh downplayed it a bit shall we say right. but i found this other stuff on the internet that really got through the the um all right yeah so we'll show want, that should we show you the tank then yeah right yeah. i see you started yeah. on it so that's really got under it look look yeah you know if i make a mistake you know we do make mistakes uh yeah well yes. i do yes yes because we're only human aren't we there's a song in there somewhere I thought you were going to break out in the song then. I was, but they must I, give for that with me. I, I, I paused. Was, we're only human after all. We're only human after all. Don't put the blame on me. I was going to do that one. But I don't even recognise that one, but there you go. The <laughs> musician. Yeah, so it's gone down to bare metal there. I was going to bare metal it. That's what I was going to do. Right. So I'm quite chuffed with that. That's, that's, oh, it's uh, made of metal then? It's yeah. not like a fibreglass no, or plastic or that's something That's the stuff like that. I got off of um, eBay. I just bought a little bit of it and just to see what it was like. Oh, it's really that. good. Look at that. It looks like a superhero, doesn't yeah. it? What's it called? Cloister. Cloister Man. <laughs> Cloister Man. Cloister Man. Right. Cloister Man. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it works in a church, apparently. I'll tell you what, um, I think you need to do that again. You did that so well. <laughs> <laughs> you face the camera with your hands on your hips and do that again. Hold that. Cloister man. Right, there we go. Right. So, yeah, it's gone down to bare metal. So, that'd be good because that, that started reacting almost within five minutes, where the other stuff was on there an hour and it didn't do anything. It was like. <laughs> Right, but this stuff's here. Yeah, so I mean, it looks really bad now because there's all there's layers and layers oh, of all sorts on there. It's so. like a terrible state, doesn't it? Yeah, I spend a bit of time on that and that clear it off. I might yeah. even get Gary our um, uh, vapor man to give it a blast while we're down there. Take right. that as well, so it gets it all off. Right. Yeah, it looks in a terrible old sorry old state, doesn't it? But there you go. Yeah. There you go. They yeah. do, didn't they? They yeah. do. Right. So should we try this bike in? What, you're going to actually yeah. put some fuel in it, yeah. try and fire it up? Yeah. You remember the last time we tried firing yeah. it up? I'm not confident, but we see. We've got fresh fuel and we haven't, we're not using the old tank, so hopefully that should sort of, mm, yeah. Right, there's fresh fuel in that. Lovely. So. That's almost like a, and you'll be very used to this, wouldn't you, knowing your times that you spent in hospital. It's like one of them things that yes. they have on a pole, don't they? You intravenous know, I, drip. That's the thing. Where I'm intravenous and you're... Thank you very much. Um, anyway. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So I've put choke on, pulled the choke on. Right. Um, what, you, you, what, what's happening? Are you going to go for it? We go for it, should we? What, should what, we what do you reckon's going to happen? I don't know. Fingers crossed. Yeah. Oh! 
smokey's in, it's warming up. I said it's typical as soon as I was No, I just turned it off because yeah. it has got a misfire and we're getting we're getting smoked out. But yeah. it starts and the choke's in and it ticks over, so we're happy with that. Yeah, so that's we're that's sort of that. uh Yeah the carbs probably need setting up, it's just not it's not running. Yeah. <laughs> those leads, couldn't it? Yeah. It's a pig over now, which you weren't doing before. No. It's got slight this far, but I've got new plugs. I think we need to put those new leads in that on, but we were it's running anyway. Yeah. So we've had quite a successful, well, you've had quite a successful yes. night, haven't you? Yeah, got a bike from, going. Yeah, apart from denting me van. Anyone know a good body man? Because I, I can't get the money to get, no. I can't get the money together to do the uh, the excess on the insurance, so I've got to go privately, so we need a really good body man. Anyway, go ahead, Brian. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. so the boat's running, yeah. the tank's on its way, yeah. the, 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 the seat bit that is yeah. down there is, is like all primed up yeah. already. Just a little bit of jiggly pokey yeah. done in on it. So yeah. it, it won't be long before we're going to see Gary get the boat with blasting done, which is good. Right, mm. on that note. Oh, yeah. you want to do your doobie, don't you? Yes. You don't, know, with the old, uh, yes. all that, all that. Yes. Go on then. Don't forget to like and subscribe, give us a thumbs up and a lovely comment. A lovely comment would be fantastic. Thank you so, so much. <laughs> <laughs> I bumped into this Aldi bloke last week and do you know what? He was using two massive chips as walking sticks. Yeah. I said to him, what are you doing? He said, they're McCain's. Newport curry, that's fantastic. I like the chicken tarka. Chicken tarka? Yeah, it's like a tikka, but a little lot of...